Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I just wanted to come on and share some encouragement with all of you and answer some questions that I've had in the comment sections. So through many of the words that have been posted on my channel here, uh, a lot of the consistent words that are being shared, the Lord is asking for all of his children, for all of us to share the gospel with others, to tell and warn of his imminent return, that he is coming for the bride, that people need to repent of their sins and they need to come back to him because time is running out before he comes for his bride. And I know that many of you out there may be homebound and may not be able to get out there to street preach and all kinds of, you know, other ways and means of sharing the gospel with others, especially publicly, or even could be in a situation where you're not sure what to say. As far as wanting to know what to say to somebody, just ask the Lord to please give you the words to speak, and he will. Ask him for whatever it is that you're needing. If you don't know what to say, ask him for the words to speak to those that he is putting on your heart to speak to, and he will give you the words to say. He says that in, in the scriptures. Also, um, for those who are homebound, you can share um, videos and the messages and warnings that the Lord is leading you to share. Share those on the other um, platforms, whether it be TikTok or Instagram or on Facebook, which, whichever platform it is that you're using. You can keep sharing those things publicly to others because those things are being viewed worldwide. So these messages are getting out there worldwide. We don't necessarily always get to see the, the, the whole scope of how far these messages are re reaching to, but the Lord knows and he will get them to who needs to hear them. We just need to trust in that. I myself, when coming out with this ministry or this channel, and sharing the words as the Lord has led me to. Um, I wasn't very comfortable either with publicly speaking to anybody. And even still to this day, if I was to go to the public store or a mall or wherever, I wouldn't be comfortable to just start saying, hey, everybody, call out to Jesus. I, I'm a little shy when it comes to stuff like that. But I found a way around that to say what I need to say precise and clear and whether people take it to heart or reject it, it's up to them, but at least they're seeing it. And so what I had done is gone to the store and got some blank um, white plain t-shirts so that I could get some fabric paint of my own and just put messages on there myself. And so one of the examples is I got this t-shirt and I just did this. I put, Jesus is coming, are you ready? And then on the back of my shirt, it says, rapture ready. So just something simple like that. And I don't speak or say a word to anybody while I'm walking by them. It's precise, it's to the point, it's pretty clear, self-explanatory. And I've gotten a lot of interesting looks, but hey, at least the message is getting out there without me having to open my mouth and say anything to anybody about it. Um, another thing is uh, my niece, Caitlin, she makes uh, crafts and bracelets and so forth. And I asked her if she could make me this bracelet because I would like to wear it when I'm in public. So this is it here. I asked her to do this with the two crosses and put I love Jesus on there. And so I can wear this out publicly. I also have this ring here. I'll take it off. <laughs> and there's this ring here. And it says Jesus all the way around it like that with the fish. And so I always show that to everybody as well too. And um, anyway, that's uh, 
some other of the ways that you can share the Lord with others. Um, but yeah, he, he will give you the words to speak if he is putting it on your heart to go out there publicly to speak to others. And again, if you're not able to leave and go anywhere, if you are homebound, you can still share, you know, the gospel and share that Jesus is coming and to be rapture ready just by posting things online through the internet at all the different platforms that you do have available to you, whether it, again, it's Instagram, Facebook, which, whichever one that, it, that you're using, please share them to those platforms because the Lord will make sure that whoever needs to see them will see them. So those are, those are ways that you can also help to get the messages and warnings out there. So I just, I hope that this encourages you all. I, I pray that you will all keep looking up, keep your focus always on Jesus. Uh, pay attention, of course, to the things that are, go that are going on, but do not let any fear, you know, take a hold of you or or anything like that. Trust completely in Jesus. He has us and he's coming very, very soon to take us home. And that's all that we should be focusing on and being prepared for and ready for because he can come at any moment. As even one of the last messages that I did share there, and I keep getting that too. He keeps pressing that on my heart that I'm coming at any moment to be ready at any moment of the day because yeah he we're not going to get a, a warning it's just gonna happen so anyway i hope this will encourage all of you and uh yep keep looking up keep in that uh steadfast relationship with the lord and always take everything to him if you are having any struggles if you are having any fear anxiety worries any of those things take them to him go and lay it at his feet and ask him to help you through those things and he will he will answer you because he loves you he loves all of us and he's right there to pull us through any situation and any struggle any circumstance that we are having a hard time with and he is there just as much as well with all the good things that we are going through as well too so Anyway, you will all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you, and I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.